So this question says a company that provides whale watching tours takes groups of 21 people at a time, right? So 21 people at a time. The company's revenue is $80 per adult, okay? And $60 per child, all right. If the company's revenue for one group consisting of adults and children was $1,440, so let's just think about that. So $80 per adult, so I'm gonna say 80 times A, a representing the number of adults, plus $60 per child, so I'm gonna say 60 times C, with C representing the number of children. When you add all that together, you're gonna make $1,440. But we also know that there's only 21 people in a group. So that means A plus C, or the number of adults plus the number of children, has to equal 21. So I'm using a strategy translate word problem here, where I just want to get these words or these sentences into mathematical form. So I think I'm satisfied that I've done that so far. So then how many people in the group were children? So we're basically finding out what is the value of C. So I am going to treat this like a system of equations, because it is. I want to find the value of C. So I'm going to take my A plus C equals 21. Let me just erase this C question mark here. Take my A plus C equals 21 and turn that into A equals 21 minus C. The reason why I would do that is so now I can replace this A here with 21 minus C. So I'm using a process called substitution for a system of equations. The reason why I'm using that is now if I replace A with 21 minus C, because that's what A equals, and I have plus 60C equals 1440, I now have an equation that only has C involved, right? So now I can just solve for C and find my answer. So I'm going to grab my calculator and figure out what is 80 times 21. It's 1680. 80 times negative C becomes minus 80C plus 60C equals 1440. This becomes 1680 still. Negative 80C plus 60C is negative 20C, so minus 20C equals 1440. Subtract 1680 from both sides. Right, I'm doing all this just to get down to solving for C. I'm left with negative 20C is equal to negative 240, and then divide both sides by negative 20, and I'm left with C is equal to negative divided by negative is positive, 240 divided by 20 is 12. So there is my correct answer, which is choice C.